Welcome to this supersonic high altitude flight tutorial for the MSFS Halo Pelican. Today we're going to take the Pelican to over Mach 1 at around 60,000 feet and stay there. As we all know the quickest way to gain height initially in the Pelican is to use full throttle in VTOL mode. This will take us comfortably to around 30,000 feet, don't forget to raise your landing gear on the way up. The Pelican's VTOL engine seems to have a hard limit of around 30,000 feet so at this altitude the plane will stop climbing. We'll now switch the flight mode into regular flight and keep the throttles pinned. Initially you'll want to keep the Pelican straight and level as it accelerates. At 30,000 feet you'll notice that Pelican wants to pitch up and start to climb. Keep the nose around or just below 10 degrees of pitch up and you'll continue to gain both speed and altitude. During this climb and acceleration at about 40,000 feet you should pass through Mach 1. Continue to keep the nose in a gentle pitch up and the throttles fully forward. At this point you'll want to be looking at your Mach number and make sure that is increasing, as well as your altitude. Around 56 or 57 thousands, you'll likely see a reduction in the rate of acceleration and vertical speed. After all these are air breathing engines and the atmosphere is thinner at higher altitude. It's now time to level off the Pelican and settle into supersonic high altitude cruise. To do this we simply engage altitude hold on the autopilot and keep the throttles fully forward. You can now relax and enjoy the views. If you want to descend or follow a navigation plan, you can combine this video with some of the techniques used in my full flight tutorial, which is linked in the pinned comment below. Thank you for watching, I hope you found this useful. If you did, please drop a like and feel free to subscribe as I make this kind of content fairly regularly. Take care and I'll see you next time.